Hello everyone, this is Teacher Gon. In our today's video, we will talk about operation on functions. So without further ado, let's do this topic. So what we have here guys are two functions, function f and function g. For function f, we have f of x is equal to 2x plus 1, while in function g, we have g of x is equal to x squared minus 4. And we are asked to find these four operations. The first is addition, subtraction, multiplication, and division. We're going to add, subtract, multiply, and divide these two functions. But bear with me, guys. In these four different operations, the arrangement is very important. So let's start with this one. So we have f of g, f plus g of x. So how are we going to perform this f plus g of x operation? So as you can see, the first function is f. We will add them. Our f is equal to 2x plus 1. So what we need to do is to enclose this by parentheses. Pero yung iba naman kasi hindi nila in-enclose by parentheses yan. Then plus your function g which is equivalent to x squared minus 4. So as you can see, this is your function f, this is your function g, and we will add them. And simply lang yung rule natin guys, combine like terms. Here, we have 2x and x squared. We cannot combine them, though meron silang parehas na x, but their exponents are different. So as is, we will copy x squared, then plus 2x. And as for the constants, we have negative positive 1 or plus 1, and then negative 4. If we will add them, the answer is negative 3. And as you can see, this is the value of f plus g of x. This is now the final answer for the first operation. Let's proceed with the second operation. We have f minus g of x. In this part, sobrang importante na tama yung arrangement natin. So let's figure it out. We have x, f, minus g of x. We will start with f, that is 2x plus 1. And close natin by parentheses. Then minus your g which is x squared minus 4. For the first part, what we need to do is to copy 2x plus 1. While here, in our function g, since we have here a negative, we will change the signs of each term na meron tayo dito. Parang ano lang siya, yung multiply natin to negative sign sa labas, dahil ito ay positive, and this one is negative. So negative times positive is negative, so this will be negative x squared. Here naman, sa negative 4 natin, negative times negative is positive, and then we have 4. We're not yet done, guys, because we still need to arrange the terms of this operation, and we will combine 1 and 4. First, we will copy negative x squared. This must be the first term. Then this one plus 2x. Then for the constants, we have 1 plus 4 that is equal to 5. So what we have here, the value of f minus g of x is simply negative x squared plus 2x plus 5. And this is now the answer for the second operation. Now let's move on with the third operation. This one is f g of x or simply f times g of x. So let's try f times g of x. This is multiplication. We will start with the f. Our f is 2x plus 1. We will substitute that. And then for the g, we have x squared minus 4. What are the addition or subtraction because this is multiplication? Since we have two binomials, we will use the FOIL method. Okay? 
So we will multiply 2x times x squared. The answer is 2x cubed. Next, 2x times negative 4. We have negative 8x. Next naman, 1 times x squared, that is plus x squared. Here, 1 times negative 4, we have negative 4. Then, we will arrange the terms again. So, we will have f times g of x is equal to, we will start with the term with the highest exponent. This is 2x cubed followed by plus x squared, next minus 8x, then we have our minus 4. And this is now the value or the evaluated f of g of x. Let's have the last one. We have the division. This is f over g of x. As you can see guys, the numerator is f. So we will start with 2x plus 1 over your denominator g, which is x squared minus 4. Now in this case guys, we need to uh, not be sensitive if we can factor the numerator and we can, or we can factor the denominator and then eventually if meron tayong mga cancel but in this case this one is the final answer wala na tayong pwedeng ma-factor dito pero syempre meron na tayong restriction kasi x squared minus 4 to eh. dapat hindi magiging undefined yung ating denominator so lagyan tayo ng restriction dapat yung x natin is not equal to positive negative 2 so I hope guys you learned something from this video dahil Importante ang knowledge about operation and functions, lalo sa grade 11 students, across different strands. Now guys, as part of our routine, I will let you do this activity. We have f of x is equal to 3x plus 1, then g of x is equal to 2x minus 3. I want you to find f plus g of x and f minus g of x. All you need to do is to add and subtract them. So I hope guys you learned something from this video, and if you're new to my channel, don't forget to like and subscribe at hit na rin bell button para updated ka sa ating latest video. So yun guys, peace out! So yun guys, peace!